Good morning, friends. Happy, well, it's Saturday for us, Sunday for you. Um, and welcome to day two of Vlogtober. Today is Saturday, like I mentioned, and normally on Saturday mornings, we have a little routine. We go play tennis, we have coffee and breakfast, and then we go to the farmer's market. We were not thinking we'd be able to do any of that today because Hurricane Ian was supposed to be like hitting us, like not the hurricane, but like tropical storm version of it was supposed to be here today, but apparently it's not, or it's not gonna rain until like later this afternoon. We're getting started a bit later. It's about 10.30, I think, somewhere between 10.30 and 11. And we're going to go play some tennis. I think we're going to get coffee first and then, uh, yeah, play some tennis. And then probably we'll have time for the farmer's market because they close at noon. So that's the plan. And then also on Saturdays, I typically do like a reset day. I um, clean the house. Usually by Saturday, there's a lot of laundry for me to fold because Obes does the laundry throughout the week. And things along those lines. So it's pretty much gonna be a reset day in my life and um, also some tennis in there. back home and it's time to start cleaning um oftentimes on Saturdays I'll add things like an additional project that I want to do on top of just like cleaning up but today honestly like here's the plan I want to tidy like basic clean every room in those rooms I have you know plants to tend to choose when to take care of the plants I have two baskets of laundry to fold and I need to go to the grocery store. So, um, and like I'm getting over a cold still. I'm trying to like not kill myself. So, um, that's probably plenty for the day. I don't think I'm going to add anything to it. Um, and I leave for Bali this week. So, um, I probably have some, a little of like pre-packing to do and just checking in on things that I need to do before I go. So, that being said, the way I typically do this is I'll do a room, take a break, do a room, take a break. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start with the kitchen, which is pretty clean already. The thing I just need to do is clean the espresso machine, put some dishes away, wipe down the counters, and clean out the fridge. So, and like vacuum.
could hear my father's voice He would tell me to move on He would say I be just fine Okay, so kitchen and living room are clean and I think I'm going to hold off on grocery shopping until tomorrow or Monday because we're not in desperate need right now that like the time's going to make sense because I still have the dining room, our bedroom, Obi will do the bathroom. Um, so I think I'm going to, I think I'll wait. Um, for now, I'm going to make a little electrolyte beverage. We use these element tea, um, things they sponsor the podcast and I'm I'm just obsessed with them they give us so many um and I use them all the time I'm gonna use the watermelon which is my fave my fave my favorite um you mix it with water and then um this one tastes like I think like Jolly Ranchers um although it doesn't have any sugar in it which is nice but it does give you like the potassium and the sodium that you need to rehydrate. I'm gonna fill mine up and then I'm gonna take another break before I do the dining room. Um, I think I've been reading a book today. I just started it called, I think like the Secret Society of Witches or something like that. Um, and it's cute. It's like, I think it's like more like young adult romance type books, but um, pretty adorable. And yes, yeah, so I'm gonna sit down and read a chapter of that, and then we'll hit the dining room. Um, my if you might hear like our kiddo playing with like a finger skateboard in there, so um, it's called a tech deck. It's called a tech deck. Yeah, can you, you want to show them your tech deck? I just realized I had one, that was nice. Yeah, there's some. Companies, or you can buy boots with them. What? No way. For your fingers. Like for your, you have those finger feet. Yeah, but I mean, they don't connect to the skateboard. Oh, I just wonder if it would be fun. Um, I also wanted to say that whenever, like, I clean the living room on a day that we're still using the living room, one of my favorite things is to still leave blankets out and kind of leave them on the couch, and it doesn't look as tidy. But I think this is something that I got from going to Denmark and just like how they put blankets everywhere. Like if you go to a coffee shop, a lot of times there's like blankets on the back of the seats and stuff like that, even outside. And it just made everything feel so cozy. And like I knew I could use a blanket if I wanted a blanket. If I was feeling chilly, I could just have a blanket. <laughs> um, and I think that that's the vibe of keeping them out on the couch. Um, even if it's not like the prettiest thing, I think... It just feels so cozy. Like it's just, the couch is meant to be sat on. So that's something I was thinking about today. Yeah, he would tell me we have time. Time to laugh and time to heal. Our favorite song is on repeat. Drinking wine until the dawn. Knowing soon we'll be back home. We're in the last room, which is the bedroom, which the way that I tend to clean is I just move things from the room that I'm in to the room where they belong. So since this is the last room, this is the most exciting room. Um, but I have a new Lee, which is my the service I used to rent clothes from. I um, sent mine back early so that I could get it in time for Bali. So I ordered a bunch of 
warm weather clothes to take with me when I go. So um, I'll show you, I'll show you what I got. I also am looking for jeans right now. I used to buy American Eagle jeans, but they um, quit selling my size and I'm pretty mad about it. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like a lot of these stores, they get like credit for going plus size and then they just kind of back out on everything they said they were doing. <laughs> so um, yeah, I have a bone to pick. But here's dress number one. A lot of like maxi dresses, maybe all maxi dresses. I think all maxi dresses. Um, and you'll see these, I'm vlogging while I'm in Bali, so you'll see these in action, hopefully there. Dress number three. And dress number four. I think the, this and dress number three are the same, I think. Um, they both have kind of like a cutout that like goes to the side. Um, yeah, so I'm excited about that. I also got a pair of jeans. These are um, Anthropology. And they're like, you know, I think I would call them straight leg <laughs> jeans. Um, and then I got another pair to try. And these are from Pilcro, which is a brand at Anthropology. Um, and these are also kind of straight. So that's the newly. I'm gonna, I think go ahead and put the, or try the dresses on and then put them in my suitcase um because i'm not going to be able to wear them in the next couple of days it's too chilly here um and then we'll i'll put the jeans in my rotation for the week's clothes and then we'll i'll come back and we'll clean the room <laughs> All right, friends, I think that is about it for our day. I'm going to make some dinner, edit you, and then I'll see you tomorrow for day three of Vlogmas. I'm gonna have a hard time not saying Vlogmas. But um, yeah, that's the general reset day. Saturdays tend to wear me out, honestly. And that's usually fine as long as Sundays I can just chill. Um, Sometimes chores from today like bleed into tomorrow, which makes that a little bit harder. Like tomorrow I'll need to go to the grocery store, um, stuff like that. But at the same time, that's just life sometimes, you know? And I could ask Obes to go to the grocery store, but I just would rather do it myself. So that's it for the day. And thanks for joining me. I hope it helped you to get some stuff done that you wanted to get done. And um, I'll see you tomorrow for a day of self-care. Bye.